Assam gears up to celebrate Kati Bihu. The auspicious harvest festival is observed on the first day of the Kati month in the Assamese calendar. The festival marks the relocation of the rice crop and the beginning of the fresh harvest season. Kati Bihu is an observation of service and hope for a beautiful future. The festival is celebrated across the state of Assam, although all Assamese tribes have their own rituals and interpretations of the day. Lamps are lit outside the homes and a pathway of bamboo is constructed as a trail for the ancestors. Kati Bihu is also known as Kongali Bihu and is a unique festival observed in India's northeastern state of Assam. It usually falls in the middle of October and is celebrated with a sober flavor. There is less merriment amongst the observing folks as the festival is all about the constraining condition of the month. Despite being one of the grandest observation of the land, the spirit of the holiday is not joyous. Rather, the festival reflects on the year by go. The month of October is the sowing season in Assam, which the freshly sprouting paddy fields and the empty greeneries are symbolic of the Konga, which translates to bro. Kati Bihu is one of the three most significant festivals of the Assamese people, including Bhogali Bihu and Rongali Bihu. Goddess Lakshmi, who is worshipped as the distributor of wealth and mortal souls, is worshipped and welcomed into homes on the day. Outside their homes, people light eastern lamps under the Tulsi plant. The tradition of burning the lamps dates back to ancient celebrations when the lanterns on the paddy field attracted insects and served as a natural insecticide. To guide the ancestors' home, traditions lamps sake are placed on the top of bamboo sticks. Offerings are made in every family followed by the lighting of more eastern lanterns in the greeneries, gardens and paddy fields as well as prayers for a bountiful harvest. These lamps, paired with the whirling of bamboo sticks while reciting Roa Khoa chants are thought to keep pests and evil eyes away from the crops, resulting in a rich harvest. Kati Bihu is celebrated with great sincerity by the entire state. It is one of the few unique festivals of India which surpasses religion, social status and caste as people from all walks of life come together and observe the solemnity of their conditions. The day is a perfect homage to the laws of nature. From nourishing food to healing sunlight, the day is a perfect homage to the law of nature. From nourishing food to healing sunlight, nature gives us all. The harvest cycle depends on the turns of the season and with Kati Bihu, we honor the fall that allows us to sow the seeds, so that come spring we may bear the fruits. News Desk Report, My News Any. Scodemy, an online learning app. Eta porha hobo hohos. Novomur pora dadok sheni loke, neat jidabeli, a PSC or onion ejuti porika, hompuna pythocrom. Eta babokebos cordemi apot. Eta porha hobo hohos.